Uh, Rick, as your stock pick for today? I think um, it's in the US, and as people might be aware, there's been a huge shift from your mega cap companies into the um, smaller mid cap value companies. Um, I don't like the fact that people are mentioning value, but there's certainly a shift of funds into the mid to small cap sector. Um, don't go for value companies in the sector, go for growth companies, because when interest rates are going down, um, companies which seemingly offer value because of various reasons are probably going to do worse because the income, you know, because it just shows you a slowing market. So go for a growth company mm. in the small cap sector or mid cap sector. One of those is ABM Industrials. Um, um, listed in New York, and if you think about what they do, think of Bidvest locally. ABM um, provides services to, um, you know, whether it be catering or whether it be um, uh, cleaning your building, that kind of thing, a parking lot management, to a variety, a huge variety of companies in the U.S. They've been listed since 1909. They've never dropped their dividend. Um, mm -hmm. ROE is looking great. Earnings growth looking great. Um, um, it's a growth company in the mid to small cap sector. I think that's where you've got to concentrate. Interesting. JP, on your side? Tonight, I'm going for Stellantis. It's one of the top five biggest motor vehicle manufacturers. They own brands such as uh, Peugeot, Citroën, uh, Fiat, Chrysler, uh, Alfa Romeo, Jeep, uh, Dodge, Ram, uh, even Maserati, although apparently they, they're considering to chop that one. And they came out with results recently that were below expectations. But the share price has taken a big knock mostly because they've got too much inventory in the U.S. Um, they, they are sitting with too many cars that they haven't sold yet. I do expect the second half will be better, that they'll uh, sell a lot of those cars. And they've spent a lot of money, um, billions of euros, to invest into electrical cars. The uh, small Fiat that you might remember from the previous James Bond movie, the latest one, um, has been selling like, uh, like hotcakes in Europe. So uh, at a PE of roughly five times, Mm -hmm. It's uh, cheaper than any of the other major motor manufacturers. And I think they'll sort out their inventory issues and grow their sales from here, especially because of all the money they've put into EVs and hybrids as well. So Stellantis is my stock pick tonight. All right. Well, thanks so much for your time and for your analysis today, gents. Much appreciated. That is all for tonight's Stock Watch. Thanks to our guest, Jean-Pierre Verstad from Protea Capital Management and Regis Reyes from PSG Hall in One Reimsach. Up next, the close. Stay tuned. Thank <laughs> you.